The Lord be with you. Good day everyone. Let us reflect today on the gospel according to St. Mark chapter 8 verses 11 to 13. The Pharisees were asking for a sign. But Jesus said, no sign will be given. They looked for a sign not because they wanted to believe. They were looking for a sign because they wanted to ridicule Jesus. They want that people will cast their doubt on Jesus. Despite the many things that Jesus performed, so many miracles, they want to discredit the power of Jesus. Have you ever experienced being discredited by those people who don't believe in you? You have exerted effort, you have proved your worth, you have given your all, you have given all the thing that you can. And in fact, many people were actually happy for what you did. But there will always be people who will not believe that you can do great things. And they will always look for loopholes. They will always look for that opportunity to discredit and to pull you down. Do not validate their doubt on you. Just like what Jesus did. They were doubting Jesus, but he did not engage. Because for Jesus, I have shown you enough. In the same way, in our relationship with the Lord, never doubt the power of God in you. Just because the sign given to you by the Lord is not the sign you were expecting, it doesn't mean that the Lord is absent in your life. Sometimes it's good to look for the obvious. Do not look for things that are absent in your life because those things that are present are already enough signs for you to believe and to say, God is alive. God has been on your side all throughout. Do not question God. Do not ask for a sign. Rather, appreciate everything that He did for you. In the same way that you will choose to ignore those people discrediting your good works. So let us not discredit the good works that the Lord has done in our life. Let those be good enough proofs that the Lord is present and ever alive in our life. God bless.